Hello again, welcome back. Um, next up is the second movie in the Indiana Jones 4 movie collection, the 4K sets. This will be Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. So just move that out of the way. Just a quick look to show you the disc again. So I am reviewing the disc. Okay, just open up the inside to show the disc. There it is. So just going to put it in the player now and uh, let's have a look at it. Okay, so the disc is just going into the Pioneer LX800 player. So we'll just go through the menu, show you the languages that we've got. Then we'll look at the audio tracks, the subtitles, and we'll have a look at the Max CL for the 4K transfer. Okay, so those are the languages that we've got. So I'm going to select English. Again, we can't skip this. Okay, so pretty similar menu screen to Raiders. So once again, there's your languages and your subtitles. And again, Dolby Atmos is the only version available for the English track. So we lose the DTS HDMA track from the Blu-ray uh, into the extras. And that's all we get on this one. Teaser trailer and theatrical trailer. So... Let's fire up the movie. And um, we can't skip this. Okay, and we're in. Let's have a quick look at the stats. Okay, so it's mastered to 4,000 net. The maximum CLL on this is 1,000 and the average is 346. So I'm going to sit back and enjoy the movie now and I'll see you later. OK, just finished watching the movie. Um, transfer wise, I wasn't really blown away as much as I was with Raiders of the Lost Ark. I just thought Raiders of the Lost Ark was really, really strong looking. This one has its up and downs. Um, this scene's quite good. Um, just thought some of it like a little bit hazy. Um, Obviously, it's a source material, perhaps. I'd have to look at the Blu-ray, but just initial opinion, it just didn't blow away on more scenes than what Raiders did. Um, there's a good shot coming up now where they were crossing the desert. The primary colours really pop in there. Great detail, great colours. The white colour gamut coming through. Obviously, the lighting outside the palace, as you can see there, was quite strong. Very good uh, image. Clarity inside as well when they're at the banquet. As you can see, great looking colours again. Um, down at the ceremony as well. Um, pretty good. At the moment when Andy um, Indy looks at the rocks, 
a strong reflection of light as you can see on the face um, good bit of um, good bit of grain on the picture as well it wasn't um, dnr to death um, so it was quite good looking I'd like to see a bit of texture in the background because as you know grain is natural so you know it's got good details in there uh, primary colors again there the greens looking really strong um, so overall i was happy with the picture quality just not as good for me as raiders um, atmos wise again music up top in the heights uh, when there were sounds effects up above we got that for the fights so yeah thanks for watching and i'll be back with the last crusade